7 Weather is presented by Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration. Quite the warm weather we're experiencing for the midpoint of our work week. We can finally in sight what's in store for the rest of this work week. Change in pace, especially for most of February, where temperatures have been well above our climatological average for today. We should be in the low 40s and we're far exceeding that thanks to that southerly wind. But with that southerly component to our wind, a surge of moisture starts to come into the Ohio River Valley. And that's going to mix with our next weather system that's providing the ingredients necessary for potential precip that we can expect to see. Cloud coverage also starting to make a guest, uh, or I guess, welcomed or unwelcomed appearance back across the uh, Buckeye State itself. And our next system is actually starting to brew and form along the central plains into areas of the mighty Mississippi, northeastern Arkansas, western Kentucky and Tennessee. That has its sights set with the expectation of widespread rainfall back across our region as we head in through the day tomorrow, even continuing on likely through Friday morning. Things wrap up rain related by eight, nine o'clock. Drying cold for our Saturday, starting to see that warmer weather return as we head into our Sunday. Monday, good news, especially if you're trying to do something outside and take advantage of the weather. You've been able to take advantage for near all of February where temperatures have far exceeded that climatological average next round of potential precip returns Tuesday and Wednesday. And yes, we do have active weather in the forecast for tomorrow. Middle 50s for daytime highs. We stay warmer than our average, but it's also going to be a bit breezy at times. We'll blow sustained 10 to 15 gusts of 30. Let's just call it a noticeable wind. It will Notice it, especially as we're trying to run in and out of the grocery store, work and school needing the umbrella. Let's time out when this rainfall comes through with an updated look at predictor. Again, we'll notice an increase in cloud deck as we head into the early morning hours of our Thursday. Rounds of moderate to heavy rainfall scattered about between 6, 7, pushing on 8 o'clock. And we go through the same song and dance off and on. Rain showers continuing through Thursday morning into the afternoon and then becoming a bit more widespread but lighter. Thursday night into early Friday morning and then we'll pretty much be uh, wrapped up everything rain really let's say by six seven o'clock more so let's just say eight nine o'clock well, I would not be surprised if we see just a little bit of filtered sunshine as we head into Friday afternoon and evening and we'll go what rain but it's going to start to cool off by Friday afternoon and evening how much rain are we talking generally speaking still good model agreement generally right around that half inch upwards to three quarters of an inch Areas uh, at least north of I-70 could experience an inch plus within that moderate to heavy pocket of rain, and I do expect that to occur, but uh, still in good agreement right around that 0.5 to 0.75 for how much rain we can expect to see through our day Friday. I also expect it to be a bit breezy. We discussed that sustained 10 to 15 gust of 30 possible. We max out on Friday still above our climatological average right around 50 degrees colder as we head into our Saturday. We mix in sun and clouds through Sunday, but warm up to near 60 degrees on Monday. Scattered showers in the forecast Tuesday and Wednesday and our temperatures skyrocketing into the middle 60s. What a way to end February 2024.